Are you a Christian? Of course I am. Are you? Are you, the are you the born, rest you're I born again? Gamble. What's I, your problem? I, I, so many, man. You, I Come in. Take that and move that and give your heart to the Lord. Would you, you pray with good, man. Would you pray with me now? Go on, I'll listen to you. Go no, on. Seriously. Go on. Oh, say, Lord, say, Lord Jesus, come into my life. Change my heart. My name is John Paul Joseph. Come into my heart. Change my life. Change my life. Make me a new person. Make me a new person. In Christ Jesus. Do you really believe that? I was born at the altar. I was an altar boy in Malta. Yeah. And I was like John Paul Joseph. Yeah. And then I went the wrong way. Well, then, uh, God's brought you back. I, think you like to do I see you rise from the dead, then, in that chair. And yeah. you're still strong. I know. We miss you. We need you back. I'm back, man. Come on, get up there and do your thing. Yeah. He's, he's risen. He's risen. Yeah, he's, he's, he's risen on the Sabbath. He's risen on, risen on the Sabbath. Do you know what day of the week it is? Yeah, it's it's Sunday. It's Sunday, yeah. The real but it's Sabbath. Easter Sunday. Easter. No it doesn't matter what yeah. Easter is. It's one of the greatest days of history. Of no Jesus Christ came out of rose the grave. from the grave. No, no came out of the grave. He rose from the dead. How many people saw him? The only How many people saw him? No Muslims. No Muslims saw him. Five hundred people. Five hundred people saw Jesus. No Muslims because you were here. There were witnesses to the truth. Jesus Christ God, rose again him. from the dead. We threw him. He's Allah not is not a real God. Don't tell stories. Mohammed don't is dead. Stories. But Jesus Christ is alive. I know that. I know what you're making. You are not, but you've got a problem. You've got a problem. You believe a lie. I thought you were gone. But you yeah, came back I'm again. Not, God, I'm not gone. Do you accept Islam? Back here. God I has given you a chance to accept Islam. Otherwise you go to state to the hand. One Lord, one Saviour, and one King. And that is Jesus. Yeah, no other test for you. Who's the Father? 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 Ah, but you get it all wrong. Who's the Holy Spirit. Who's the Father? His Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Who's the Father? Who's the Father? Who's the Holy Ghost? The Father of Jesus is the Holy Spirit. <laughs> get it right. Now listen, what about you? Are you going to give your life to Christ? <laughs> now, will you pray with me? You say Jesus life with him. Now listen, if you really pray, the Holy Spirit will come into your life. Change your life. Change your life. Say these words, Lord Jesus. No, you don't want to. Why not? You're afraid to pray. Are you afraid to pray? I'm all right, fine. I'm back. Now listen here. I was struck down with leukemia and I'm getting better. Well, I'm well, in that it? chair for the yeah. last six yeah. and, uh, As you are. As I want to tell you this. I have a saviour oh, who is healing me. Now, my saviour can heal you, but can your God heal you? What is your, who is your God? Allah. But you don't know him, do you? I know, I know my God personally. Jesus. Jesus is God. You see, you should read that. You should read it. And to give your life to Christ. Jesus is God. He was without sin. He died on the cross, but he rose again. If you die, Listen. give me someone to die after. Yeah, but that's the miracle of the gospel. Jesus Christ rose again from the dead. Your gospel has no resurrection. I believe it. Jesus is right. is no God. No now listen to me. <laughs> Jesus is God. He's not just a man. He is divine. Because he was born without sin. Are you born in sin? Have you lied? How have you lied? You see, you don't want to come to know the truth. Men love darkness rather than light because their deeds are evil. Listen, we've all done that. We've all lied. But there's forgiveness at the cross. Only Jesus Christ could change your life. Oh, man, you see after the How you? How clear you want to be? How clear you want to be? He wants to give your life to Christ. Thank you. Thank you.
He'll pray for you. So I can take that video and read it. Three, God bless you. You know, the way to heaven is through Jesus Christ. Why are you giving it back? Are you a Muslim? Oh, I see. You're brainwashed. You see, there's forgiveness and the cross. Will you read it? Good. You're free to think and feed the read. Listen to me. The Muslim accept more than you and the Jesus. No. 100% They don't accept Jesus Christ as God. That's your problem. No, no, no. That's where you go wrong. One God. If you have Listen. more than the God, yeah. The whole make God the Father, rubbish. God the Son, no, no. and God the Holy Ghost. But listen, your Where's God has never been proven to arise, raised God? from the dead. Where's Mother God? Mother God? Yes. The Holy Spirit came upon Mary. And Mary conceived the Holy Where's the Father God? And Mary Father conceived God? Jesus. Father God? Father God the Father. Who? He is there, our Father. Glory to God. You get it wrong, my friend. You get it muddled up because you've been brainwashed into thinking that you have the truth and you don't have the truth. You have lies. I only have. Listen, I want to ask you a question. Why couldn't your God have a son then? No, listen, why couldn't your God have a son? That makes your God limited, that makes your God small. He cannot do something. Listen, he cannot do that. With God, all things are possible. Get the facts right. Your God cannot have a son. That makes him weak, makes him small. But my God had a son. He is it. He can do the impossible. Now, which God is the real God then? The one who didn't have a son or the one who had a son? Now, you're scared now because you realize that you haven't got a proper God. You see, that's the problem. You've got an improper God. You've got a God that doesn't really believe in you because he's not really there. He's a God in name only. I want to ask you a question. How do you get your sins forgiven? How do you get your sins forgiven? Answer this. You do the best you can and you hope that you're going to go to paradise. My friend, that will never get you to heaven and never get you to paradise. But what will get you to heaven and what will get you to paradise is you repent of your sin. Turn from your sin and turn to God and he will receive you. He has the power to forgive you because he died and rose again. He's alive because he arose from the dead. That's the, must, that's the mystery of the gospel. What is a sin? The sin is I want my way. I in the center of sin. I want my way. Frank Sinatra said, I did it my way. That's exactly what sin's all about. Put himself in front of the living God. Self-righteousness will never save your soul. If you continue in that way, you'll be lost forever. Forgiveness, forgiveness is at the cross. It presupposes I have a soul. You have a soul. You have an eternal soul and it's going to heaven or hell. Where are you going to tonight if you die? Paradise. I'm going to paradise. No, you can't. Why? You're not going I'm to paradise. I'm going to gate. I've given my life to crematorium. Read it. It's free. I don't care. I wrote it myself. Let me have it, John, please. Are you going to read it? Thank you. You're not going to tear it up, are you? No, no. I'm a Christian. What do you God mean? God bless you. Just because it's free doesn't mean You see, mean the I whole take mystery it. of the gospel is this. That God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. And he died on the cross that you might be forgiven. Forgiven what? Forgiven of your sin. I see. Sin is self, vindicated, and then you're alive and you want to be God yourself. I mean, That's what sin is all about. Us? Why did God have to be killed in order to be forgiven? But you're a sinner by nature. Yeah, but why did have he you ever have told to a lie? Why did he have, have you to ever die? told a lie? Why did I'm Christ asking you. Have, to have you ever to told a lie? Everybody have you ever no, told I'm a lie? You, why did Christ have to die to forgive my sins? Because why he loved God you have enough to said, die for you on the cross. Why couldn't God have just said your sins are forgiven? He cannot just say that. No. 
because he had to pay the price and take your place as a substitute and deal with the root of sin. He's omnipotent. He's Listen, he can that's do whatever why he, he likes. became a man. He can do whatever he likes. He could have forgiven Adam my sins Adam failed as a man. Adam failed and fell into sin because of, he was a man. Now the only way to, that sin could be dealt with was that God had to become man and deal with the root of sin, which is so, I want my way. What did Adam have to do with my sins? We all became sinners with the day he refused to accept God's way in life. So if I was a newborn baby, I'd still go to hell if I croaked. Yeah. Damn good God you there. You, you need forgiveness. Damn good God there. You need forgiveness now. Not me now. But you've got to do something baby about it. baby who doesn't have the opportunity to... I'm offering you, I'm offering you a complete and free pardon of all your past. You're not offering me anything. I God am in Jesus Christ. Me. God was offering it to me, not you. No, you're, I'm offering you're what, not even a I'm his servant. For this God. I'm his servant. And Jesus Christ has commissioned me to go and preach the gospel. Can you hear he, So I'm offering you a pardon to preach the gospel from God. That? When did he do this? I got saved when I was 11. So that's the commission, is it? You I got, got saved, God so you sent got, me out so you into the world go. to preach the gospel. So I've been preaching since I was 11 old, years old. You went out there preaching. Yes. That's a long time. Saved many souls. I've led many people to the Lord. How many have you not led? I'm not going to say how many. Don't have, you, have to. Have you baptized many people as well, John? Jesus, Jesus died for you, sir. Well, he, now the pride you in your heart will say, I don't want any of him to reign over me. That's the problem. Your pride. Oh, I just, I just don't quite understand this idea of somebody having to die to forgive me. He died to deal with the problem of your guilt. What guilt? I have not, not any guilt. You have guilt about sin. You need forgiveness. There's only one way to get forgiven. That's forgiveness of your sin is only forgiven if you repent. You have to repent of your sin. Turn from your sin and give your life to Jesus Christ. It's on. Putting yourself first. Yes, that's right. I don't put myself first. When you commit yourself to Christ, you give out the right to yourself and let it be crucified. I am crucified with Christ, therefore I live not for myself, but I live the, the love of God and Christ lives in me. You got the stigmata? The resurrection. You got the stigmata? Sin has to be forgiven, sir. Unless it's forgiven and dealt with, you still have the problem. You need that forgiveness right now. Come up and give it to me. Jesus Christ is all right. Everyone knows there is only one good place. Yes, it did well.